Imagine an AI that doesn't just talk, it actually gets things done. Meet ChatGPT Agent, a powerful digital assistant built to take action, not just give advice. Whether it's booking travel, managing meetings, or crunching data with up to 89.9% .9 accuracy, this isn't your typical chatbot. It's hands-on, fast, and ready to transform how work happens online. So how is this version different from what's already out there? Regular ChatGPT was mainly for chatting. It could help write emails, do some research, or answer questions. That's about it. ChatGPT agent runs inside a virtual computer, its own workspace where it can browse, run code, and complete tasks for you. It uses a visual browser to interact with websites like a human, and a text browser to quickly read and analyze large amounts of content. A built-in terminal lets it code, calculate, and process data on the spot. API connectors allow it to access tools like Gmail, Google Drive, or GitHub, with permission. This setup makes it act more like a digital assistant that does the work, not just suggests it. ChatGPT agent can manage calendars, meetings, and provide background info on attendees. It handles research by gathering and organizing web content into clear reports. It creates documents, spreadsheets, and presentations with data, charts, and proper citations. It can compare products, shop online, and book travel with permission. Tasks are interactive. You can pause, adjust, or take over anytime. It gives real-time updates, working more like a teammate than a tool. This agent isn't just powerful. It's been tested on real-world problems. And the results are impressive. For data analysis tasks, it actually scored better than most humans. It handled spreadsheet-based tasks with much higher accuracy than tools like Microsoft Copilot. And it even passed difficult tests like investment banking simulations and advanced math problems that most AI models couldn't crack before. In some areas, the agent's results were as good as those from professionals. It doesn't mean it's replacing experts, but it shows just how far AI has come in performing serious tasks, not just basic ones. How much does it cost? As of now, ChatGPT Agent isn't available for free users. It's part of the paid subscription plans. The Plus plan costs $20 per month and gives access to the agent with up to 40 queries. The Pro plan, priced at $200 per month, allows for 400 queries and is aimed more at advanced users or professionals. Team and Enterprise plans are also available with custom options depending on how many users are involved. At the moment, it's still rolling out. Plus and team users are getting access gradually. It's already live for pro users, but it's not available in certain places like the European Economic Area or Switzerland just yet. Is it safe to use? Of course, with a tool this powerful, safety is a big deal. OpenAI has added strong protections to make sure the agent doesn't go rogue or do anything dangerous. Before it takes serious actions like sending emails or making purchases, it always asks for confirmation. There's something called watch mode that kicks in for risky stuff like financial tasks. In those cases, someone has to watch and approve each step. The agent is also trained to ignore harmful or sneaky instructions that could trick it into doing something bad. This helps protect both the users and their data. Privacy is also taken seriously. Users can delete all data from the session, log out instantly, and manage their history with just a few clicks. Still, no system is perfect. There are risks like session hijacking, data exposure, or even clever prompt attacks. So while the agent is designed to be safe, it's important to stay alert, especially when using it for sensitive things. Where can it be used? There are tons of ways people are already using ChatGPD agent. In the business world, executives use it to manage meetings, gather news, and prepare briefings. Marketers get help writing social media posts, presentations, and other content. Financial analysts use it for spreadsheets, updating data, and modeling tasks. On the personal side, it's great for travel planning, organizing events, or comparing online deals. Someone planning a weekend trip can get everything booked in one go. Or if there's a birthday party coming up, the agent can help with planning, guest lists, and even sending invites. It can also help with day-to-day -day stuff like finding a doctor's appointment, checking reviews, and booking a slot. Some might ask, is this replacing humans? Not really. It's more like a helpful partner to speed things up. People still make the decisions. The agent just handles the steps. Even though it's powerful, ChatGPT agent isn't perfect. There are still some things it's working on. Creating slideshows is one of them. It can do it, but the designs can be a little plain 
compared to what people expect from something like PowerPoint. It's functional but not fancy. Another thing is speed. While it's much faster than doing tasks by hand, complex projects can still take 15 to 30 minutes to finish. It can also make mistakes. That's why users should keep an eye on important tasks and double-check results before using them in serious situations. Memory features are turned off for now, mostly for safety. This means it won't remember anything between sessions, which helps prevent any personal info from leaking. Other companies are building similar tools, but ChatGPT Agent does stand out in some ways. Google's Gemini is really good at working with Google Apps, but it doesn't handle multi-step tasks as well. Microsoft Copilot is solid inside Office tools like Word or Excel, but doesn't browse the web or run independent workflows. There's also Claude from Anthropic. It's great for conversations and summaries, but doesn't do web browsing or app control like ChatGPT Agent can. Zapier's agents are amazing at automating tasks across apps, but need more setup and aren't as easy for beginners. So overall, ChatGPT Agent offers a strong mix of independence, tool access, and usability that's hard to beat right now. OpenAI isn't stopping here. They're already working on improvements. Better formatting for slideshows is coming soon, along with more tool integrations inside the virtual workspace. There are also plans to expand access to more countries and possibly even offer some features for free users later. For businesses, advanced team controls and more secure environments are in the works. There might even be an API so developers can build their own tools on top of the agent system. So why does this matter? This update marks a big shift in how people use AI. ChatGPT agent isn't just something to chat with anymore, it's something that acts, helps, and solves problems step by step. It's like AI is moving from being just a smart talker to becoming a digital coworker. There's still a long way to go, and it's not without risks, but the potential is real. Whether for work, personal life, or just saving time, this is something that could change how things get done online. So, what kind of task would you let an AI handle first? Let us know in the comments below. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel.